During COVID-19, we've had a huge increase in bike sales, bike service. Uh, everybody's getting their bikes out of their garage. They haven't ridden them in a few years and people who are looking for a bike to ride are out shopping for new bikes. I think people are looking for ways that are safe to get exercise, to enjoy being outside now that it's springtime and bikes give you a way to explore more of the city than just your neighborhood. There's only so many times you can walk around your block and really you know, enjoy seeing the same things all over again. Uh, but I think the main reason why people are choosing bikes is because there are fewer cars on the streets. I think people feel safe riding their bikes and uh, this is a moment when we really should embrace this and realize that there are lots of people who want to ride their bikes every day who don't because they're afraid of traffic. Yeah, so protected bike lanes are essential in a city because they allow interested but concerned riders to get out and ride. And there's a huge group of people, 60% of Londoners uh, from the data, show that they want to ride more often but they're afraid for their safety. And protected bike lanes turn the interested but concerned into the interested and enabled, who get out and go ride to go shopping at the market, who you know feel safe sending their kids to school on a bike. And they don't, and they don't do this on painted lanes, they do that on protected lanes. So more protected bike lanes let more people ride more often. The upshot for us is that we're super busy. Uh, we have you know, tons of people who have not been riding bikes, need bike repair service. Uh, we have lots of people who haven't been on a bike in you know, five, six years, a decade, 20 years, uh, coming and shopping for bikes because it's a really great way to get around. And, what they're finding is they're finding a new sense of freedom, a new sense of connection with their communities. And so from our perspective, we've, we're hiring new staff, we're super busy and trying to keep up with the incredible demand that you know, this isn't gonna be a sustained thing unless we make it safe for those people to continue riding once this is all over.